welcome you at the EW Group Clinics. So um, um, my name is Dr. Vladimir and uh, today we are going to show you the session of the hair growth treatment and uh, the stimulation of the hair growth. So basically the hair is one of the uh, feature characteristics of the, all the mammals and, and uh, the problem of the hair loss is a huge problem and uh, uh, even though that the problem of the hair loss is not life threatening, but it has some uh, impact on our uh, social and uh, sexual behavior, on our psycho-emotional state. And uh, yeah, we do treat a lot of patients um, with such problems. We have our personal idea how to do it and we um, have a great success. So today I'm going to share with you uh, the way how we do it. Uh, I'm going to tell you uh, it step by step and uh, hope you're going to like it. Okay, so the initial point of every treatment is the consultation. On the appointment day we meet with the patient uh, trying to figure out um, what was the initial uh, problem of the hair loss when it was started and we try to find a way how to solve this problem. After having the consultation we start with the hair analysis. Uh, hair analysis is an important tool for us to determine the, uh, the hair scalp condition uh, as well as the density of the hair. So we uh, usually all the aesthetic um, dermatologists have a strong agreement to take the before and after pictures uh, to collect the full clinical picture of the treatment. All right, so close-up camera will focus uh, on the scalp to determine uh, the scalp status and the number of hair follicles in that given area. Uh, this will help us to determine if uh, the patient have the healthy scalp and an average amount uh, or below average amount of the hair follicles. We are only able to grow the hair uh, if the hair follicles are presented at the affected area. Otherwise, it's just impossible. So, after taking all the measurements, we can start the treatment. So next step after finishing uh, of the cleansing is the uh, injection part. So uh, I'm going to do the injections uh, on the periphery of the scalp. Uh, I'm going to use a papule technique uh, and uh, I'm going to advance the needle right uh, on the border between the hairy part and, uh, and, the, and the skin. So, and we, uh, on the stage, we aim to improve the microcirculation. The distance between two injections is about uh, one centimeter and uh, the amount of the product injected is about just 0 0.1, 0 0.2 uh, ml per one point. The improvement of the microcirculation will be uh, especially important for the patient with telogen effluvia because uh, they, they do have uh, a recession of the, and the shading of the hair on the whole uh, area of the scalp. The next step of our treatment uh, is a stage when we are doing multiple intradermal injections into the most problematic areas. In the case of uh, androgenetic alopecia, these are androgen sensitive areas. For males, it is a frontal and temporal area, and uh, for females, it is a central part of the scalp. In the case of telogen effluvium, our uh, injections uh, will be performed on the whole area of the scalp. And uh, an interval between um, two sessions is about one week. So, for the whole treatment, uh, it, will it will take about two or three months, uh, and uh, actual the actual result of the treatment 
uh, might be seen only after two months of the finishing of the treatment, after the finishing of the treatment, because the hair needs some time uh, for the growth. Okay. Uh, also, need to mention so that the amount of the product required per one procedure is about a one vial, which is 2.5 uh, ml of the product. But in the case of telogen effluvium, the amount uh, uh, that of the product that we may use per one procedure could be high, so uh, we may use about two vials. And uh, I also need to mention that the natural hair grows with the HFR hair follicle regenerator. Uh, it's a great way for us to add some volume, add some volume and to stimulate the hair growth. Um, at the same time, uh, we can prevent the excessive and the very rapid shading of the hair, which is very important for the patient who wants to maintain the, um, the, the condition of the hair that they have um, at the time when they come to the doctor. All right, so, and uh, we also try to encourage uh, the follicles to move into the active, into the anagen phase of the growth. So the miniaturized follicles and the and the hair, uh, which is mal malnutritious, uh, we try to convert it into the active phase. All right. Okay. So I also need to mention that we change the needle several times during the procedure because they are very fine and they became uh, blunt very fast. Okay, so uh, the main components, uh, the main compounds of the HFR, uh, this uh, peptides of uh, uh, placenta and the skin. So we have just finished our first session um, of the hair scalp treatment using HFR which goes for hair follicle regenerator. So, I would like to emphasize that hair follicle regenerator is a natural product which helps you uh, to restore, to strength and to improve the condition of malnourished hair. It will help some, uh, to add some volume by the stimulating of the hair growth and it will stop uh, rapid and a very active shedding of the hair. And it is highly recommended for all the uh, aesthetic practitioners and aesthetic dermatologists who treat the patients with the hair loss problems.